on-the-scene coverage of ACC14 is supported by Janssen Pharmaceuticals, Incorporated. I think it was an incredible trial uh, showing that in high-risk patients you can safely omit surgery. In fact, uh, to see a 26% mortality reduction is, is landmark and without an increased risk of stroke. So I look forward to actually the randomized trial of balloon expandable versus self-expanding stents that will be held at this meeting to see if there is in fact a difference between the two types of stents. The problem with the balloon expandable uh, valves is that there's uh, difficulty in vascular access, there's difficulty with uh, increased risk of stroke and so that was not seen in this particular trial. In addition, I thought it was very interesting the echocardiographic findings where there's less of a residual gradient with uh, uh, the percutaneous valve and that's very important because if you have a uh, LV failure and a low cardiac output, you don't want any residual gradient.